Hello, MechWarriors. How is it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. Guys, I want to do something stupid today, and I want to see how much damage we can squeeze out of our beautiful Orion here by just stacking pirate ammunition. Uh, I think... I don't know if it's intended like that, but I think it's gonna work like that. So let me quickly go back to Tigris, because last time we've been there, we found some very interesting pirate ammunition. And um, I want to see if we can just... Put as many of these as possible into our mech and have a good time with it. Also, rare LRM5. Eh, who cares? I don't. So, here we go. We're gonna buy... Oh, even more high explosive. Okay, so we're gonna take the... Huh, the ATM plus two. And the ATM plus one. And I think... You know what? I also want these. Because they have 1200 rounds... And then we're also gonna take the high explosive ammo. Okay, guys, this is gonna be ridiculous. Let me see if it is actually working. We are building for DPS. Not Alpha Strike, but DPS. So what we want is smaller launchers, and the freed up weight is gonna help us with more damage. So currently we are sitting at 58 DPS. Drop the LRM-20s. I think the 10 rated launchers are fine. There we go. Mm-hmm. Remember, 58, guys. 58. But if we stack the pirate ammo, it'll add the plus 3 bonus damage to every single LRM that we have in our mech. Every single one. If you put the plus 2 in there, it'll add another plus 2. It'll add another plus 2. You see where this is going, guys? Okay. So, right now... We we didn't do anything. We, we didn't make the mech better by any means. We can drop the double bin, possibly. All right, here we go. Um, Give it another plus one. It's not really helping that much, to be honest. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. How does it work, then? Give me a second. I need to figure this out. So, if we were running... Mmm, it doesn't, it doesn't work the way I want it to work. Oh, no. If we put, I think, if we put the 15s in there, what we just need is a lot of launchers. There we go. There we go. There we go. So now our DPS is going way higher by only using those pirate ATM plus three. And in order to have a lot of missiles to actually have some sustain, we're gonna put this in here because that is a double bin which is even stacked further. Instead of at 1,100, we have 1,200 rounds. And that is it. That's 4.48 more DPS. It's not as good as I thought it would be, but you know what? I don't really care about the tag, so let's drop that. We're gonna get this going. Absolutely. So with that, we are able to put... Uh, not quite. We could drop a plus two. And that's what we have. So plus 10 damage per second is what we get out of here. We have a plus 32 0.02 alpha strike it is just ridiculous how much value you can get out of here the problem is our ammo count is going lower see i want one of this uh extra pirate double bin i think this is fine in terms of ammunition for the setup that we got here now i could possibly drop and a 15 And get a 10 in here? Alright. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. I wonder if stacking fives is a way. Um, we have some fives. I just want to see. So, we have one, two, three. There is a sweet spot somewhere. Where ammo is not really helping anymore. You need volume of fire at that point. But, uh, let's take a look. If we put all of the plus twos, the plus ones, and the high explosives in there. Yeah, I mean, to be clear, we have gained a lot of sustain in terms of we have a crap ton of missiles in our mech now, and our LRM-5s, we have only three LRM-5s, are almost having the DPS of a 20, another 20, and a 10, so an LRM-50, 
You see what I'm doing here? This is what I wanted to show. It's so crazy. It also gets rid of the need of cooling having these smaller launchers. Oh, guys, we have something cooking. We need to just find the sweet spot. So I think what we are doing is we're going to bring back the tens. Uh-huh. Where the hell did I put the ten? All right, on, on the side. Is this is going to be going on the arm. So if I want to go sustain, then I would probably run... Mm. This is better. Two and a half for two is better than the one. All right, so I think this is it. This is totally it. Because it also allows us to drop the royal double heat sinks. Yeah. Totally. We don't need that much cooling anymore. Our heat capacity is going now. Who cares? Absolutely. Um, and that allows us to... Oh my god. Let's get a... What do we have here? A regular double heat sink kit. Uh, put two doubles in there. We're fine with that. We are almost heat neutral. And almost as good enough. Alright. So, that being said. I want to bump the damage even further. There we go. There we go. I think this is our sweet spot. Now we have 16 damage, almost 17 damage per second with uh, an LRM5, an LRM10, and another LRM10. We have too much ammo now. Let's drop the 5, actually. Give it another 10. Uh, God, which one do we drop? This one. Okay, 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 okay. This is this is so interesting to balance, man. Uh, give me the 10. Yes, please. 20, 22.53. Yes. That is it. Heat management is going up a little bit. Uh, our weapon heat generation. But I think this is all right. This is totally fine. Click the repair all button. Say, hello, my friend. I am ready to shoot. <laughs> we, have, we have so many missiles as well now. Which leads me to think that I should probably drop one. It's too many, right? We will never run out of it. It's 440 rounds per bin. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we have 4,400 missiles. It's too many. Absolutely. So can we make this make even better by dropping... Uh, I think the high explosive ones are the most efficient ones currently. Hold up. We can get two tons out of here easily. Four tons even. Um, wait. We have an LRM-20. It's not fitting anymore. 30. 30! <laughs> it's the last bit. <laughs> no, it's fine. I like it. I like it. That allows us to get one more ton in the mag. It's another high explosive bin. 36 damage. I guess we have something cooking here, guys. <laughs> and it's not necessarily... Oh, it might be our mech. It might be our mech that's cooking. Uh, I want to I wanna get there. I want to be ridiculous here. If we drop this... Nah, we wouldn't, we wouldn't stack too much M. Now we need more missiles at that point. All right, so... Um, hmm. Hold up. Hold up. That's five missiles. 2.8. Yeah. This is, this is it. More ammo. 33. Ah, it's too much now. Yeah, I'll do it. Uh, let's get... Wait. Just to be clear. 32. Yeah, this is better here. The high explosive ammo is better. We have a better ratio. Um, yeah, it's also only one ton compared to the three tons. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So, these doubles, uh, I'll take them out again. Because I actually want to keep the royals going. Should we go one royal? One double? And then another ton of... 
another ton of doesn't work anymore. It's two tons, huh? Yeah. I think this is it, guys. We were juggling left and right. We have a 5, a 10, and a 20. I think this is it. I think this is it. Just to double check. Just to double check. We have 33 now. Let me go back to another 10. And our 10 is here. Obviously better, but we need to drop a bit of ammo. Um, I need two taunts. It's a lot of investment. It's kind of... Oh, wait, it's kind of the same by doing this. Alright. Oh, wait. Okay, I think we figured out the best way to do it. A 20 stream, an LRM-10 tier 5, an LRM-10 tier 4, a crap ton of ammo. Still not it, right? It's still not it. Get rid of these. This might just be high explosive ammo, because we got the slots. Give me another 20. Like, seriously. No. Not like that. Uh, in order to get this done, we have to get rid of these and get the plus 3 ammo in there. Uh, doesn't quite work. Sorry, it's a lot of Tetris. I know. I know. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Guys, we... Uh, 25? Hold up. High explosive here. Drop this. This could be something. I need to find the perfect balance of weight and um, and cooling and ammo count. That's my problem that I got right now. Uh, that is absolutely it. Mm, so this could be a tier 3. Looks good. Looks good. So 20, 10, 15, that amount of ammunition. Are you volatile? Yeah, you are. You are totally volatile. <laughs> oh my god. And that on a base of an XL engine. That is so crazy. Crazy is that. I like it though. I like it a lot. We have a lot of sustain now. Put it in the head. I mean, do we want to get rid of one of our pilots? Let's not do it. There is no good way to stack all of these things. So, guys, welcome to my Tetris. <laughs> all right. So, I think what we have here is going to be absolutely ridiculous. I'm going to hit the repair all button on the other guys. I don't have any intent to, to build anything with them right now because I just want to see what we can do with this. Multi-mission operation. Ooh. Independence. We can play for the independence. Oh, by the way, uh, I said earlier I shouldn't play the stronghold because it's for Devion, but it's not, it's for Kurita. I was misreading that. In that case, we will be playing the stronghold. And you know what? I like that we have so many missiles here. That is gonna be really good. I do like it. So, stronghold defense. Annihilator. Perfect for that. Uh, it's a very slow mag, but it is filled with firepower, so we can use that as a turret basically uh we got our orion which is able to see everybody everywhere and attack him um and then we can just pick and mix and match stronghold defense perfect give me all the salvage confirm that oh this is gonna be interesting so we're ready to go we have one day perfect okay guys i'm excited I hope you are too. I really hope you are too. Ah, manage, managing the ammo is um, it's difficult. It's really difficult. Especially when you want a lot of it. But not too much. Because otherwise it's dead weight. But having these high explosive ones also give you damage output. Which is uh, quite insane if you ask me. 
So kind of finding the sweet spot between I want to overpower my enemies quickly and I want to be ready for the long game is, is not easy. I think we have too much ammo now. Which means we could probably tune it back and add another five launchers. But what would that give us? Not a lot, honestly. We, we've tried to 20, but may maybe there's, there's some math somewhere in there. I think the 20 would be better as soon as we are ready to go... Was it super dark? Uh, like all high explosive and not the ATMs. Alright. Come on. I want this guy. This is the base defense Greetings, Commander. Is equipped with the following defense so... It's a very straightforward build. We have a 10, we have a 15, we have a 20. Over four AC2s. Uh huh. Four anti -air. Oh, I want anti air turrets. Three AMS. Medium laser. No. Lasers. Give me my anti air because I think everything else we can easily intercept with our leopard. Anti air turret. Here we go. Four decoys. I'm just gonna make this thing big. There we go. So if we find, if we're facing a swarm of beetles, then I think we're gonna be good. Rommel, Rommel, Rommel. Behemoth. Interesting. Wait, we need to find a way outside. Where's the gate, actually? Target acquired. All right. Got a victor. Ooh, Naga. That's double arrow. Oh, we got problems. Target acquired. Double arrow, you say. Well then, let's go ahead and shoot our weapons. Here it comes. One alpha strike is enough to take him. Secondary. What's the secondary? Destroy the op 4 scout. Alright. So we're gonna be playing a little bit of tower defense here. Using our LRMs to maximum efficiency. I'm very happy that we don't have to care about... Um... Ammo, because we have so much of it. Alright. So, there's a guy coming in. Don't really want to get my friends Target. out there. Perfect. I also need to make sure that we attack Mr. Arrow guy as soon as he is in our range. Here we go. He's not allowed to get line of sight and locks on us. But the good news is, I got locks on them, because I have a leopard. Destroyed. And Target I'm linked up to the leopard sensors. I mean, look the blue bubble. This is my view. This is my this is my my sensor radius, which is nuts. Absolutely nuts. Didn't hit. Also, didn't hit. All right, can I hit the other guy? I mean, technically, I don't really want to leave my little hidey hole here. This is interesting. We are not dealing damage. All right. I also need to be extremely careful with friendly fire, because our missiles hurt as hell. There we go. Yeah, we can deal with those. You know what? We're gonna try to take one flank first before we go. Oh, here we go. Huh? Is he coming in? He's not coming in. And I think we found the gate. Oh wait, let's go for the scout real quick. That's an extra objective. Playing it extremely safe in the first phase of the game. Alright. So, there's a Tonk. Get the Tonk out of the way. Nice. And we got three more on this side. Okay, one down. Uh, I'm destroying my own walls, which is honestly not a bad thing. I want another exit, actually. All right, this is an auto cannon two. No, wait. There was one auto cannon two turret somewhere. Maybe even on, on here. Oh, it's this one, huh? Mm, let's keep it for the moment. Let's keep it for the moment. Just want to check. Uh, a veto spawner. Sure. Get me a veto. Great. So, now I need to somehow find a way to them. I don't know. I don't know how to do it. 
Again, we can tear down these walls. Or we have to go all the way around, but I'm way too lazy to do that. Target or destroyed. we found the gate. Good. Uh, so, slow and steady. I mean, obviously, if we can... Uh, enter air turret now. Enter air turret now. Uh, and uh, and that's what I mean. Why? That's exactly what I mean. We got problemos. Flamer turret? That's not it. Why am I not attacking uh, an Igor? Let's go for the Igor. Target is down. Medium laser turret. Sure. Let's get some defenses in here. Igor! Target Igor! Target oh god. Destroyed. Am I gonna get attacked? I think yes. This is yeah, we will probably attract a lot of fire. I should not shoot Incoming for a second. Missile. Coming missile. Yeah, yeah. Target Let destroyed. me live. Please. Alright. Are we fine? I think we are. Destroyed. I think we're good, guys. Woo. Scary. Yeah, we need to get a bit of a lay of the Target land destroyed. here. Because I, I need more anti-air defense. This is the only thing that I'm really afraid of. A swarm of VTOLs. Alright, let's see. Prepare for the next wave. Okay, cool. What do we have here? An AMS turret? Sure. It's cheap. It's cheap, and it's helpful. Is this a spawner or ammunition, right? Large laser turret. Nah, I, I don't care. What do we have here? Get some egos. Ah! Now we have air yeah, superiority. Question mark. Oh my god. Auto cannon 2 turret is good enough. It is good enough. And we're gonna upgrade that thing completely. Yeah. So, here we go. Hey, friends. Yeah, shoot into the sky. That's so good. Let me try to go for the big ones. Alright. Yeah, he is... He's going down. Okay, cool. There's so much stuff in the sky, it's crazy. And we are too slow to actually Target attack destroyed. them uh, in a serious way. I mean, we got some Igors as well. There we go. Target destroyed. Target but we want to keep him in the sky for as long as possible, obviously. Alright. Alright, we're good. This anti-air turret, by the way, is doing a wonderful job. New so, target, incoming. Warhammer. Got a Warhammer, got an Atlas, got some other things too, a Banshee and a Longbow. Good to know. So the Hammer is the fastest of the bunch, so he's gonna be the one that we will attack first. We will defend that fortress at all costs. I think that I just realized though, we actually might run out of ammo. Gotta be a bit careful. Uh, 1100 meters. I need to get closer. Now we can. Hoping that he is coming even closer. There's another anti air turret. Hell yeah, let's go. Slow and steady. Uh, yeah, I think we might actually run out of ammunition. So, you got this. Thank you. Alright, so... Destroy the LRM Max. It's currently our... Uh-oh. Our objective. So, we got Awesomes. We got Stalkers. We got probably also Longbows. There's an Archer as well. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, pretty good. Should I get another Auto Cannon 2 turret? Being able to shoot into the sky is kind of crucial. So here come the missiles. They are attacking the walls. Right? Right? I don't think that our VTOLs are gonna survive this. They're probably gonna go down. New target, Cyclops. Cyclops as well. Okay, so we use the gate and probably push out a little bit. 
All right, here we go. 1400, 1300 meters, 1200. This is a little scary because we are now out in the open. But I want these guys to be gone as quickly as possible. Good headshot. All right, we got one down. Next. The amount of damage that we are throwing around is just so insane. I think three alpha strikes for an awesome is good. Uh, it's good enough. Now the missiles are coming my way. Yeah. Giving up my cover was probably a bad idea. But hey, they have indirect fire too. Seven hundred meters stalker. Oh, he's a bit up front. Relock, relock. Yeah, this is where I'm gonna not care about my ammo count. I just want them dead. And Alpha until they are collapsing. We are really well set up for this mission. Although it is kind of like an endgame or high tier thing. We have the things to actually finish it. Alright, and then you. Great. So, prepare for the next wave. We can salvage some DP while we are here. It's pretty good. And our base is still kind of untouched, so it's fine. Let's take the time here. And then probably go back to base. The other option would be not attacking and letting our turrets, you know, do the jobs. This is so crazy when the fast-moving annihilator is coming around. All right, so we got that. Extra DP being salvaged. Love it. We have a lot of points. So, back to base. It's two seconds until the next wave. Defeat the hostile units, whatever they may be. Really hope I won't have to punch out here. Uh, let me just check the All right, we got a bunch of tanks on that one side and probably a bunch of mechs on the other side. It's a setup that we have seen before. Or maybe it's just tanks. All right, gotcha. Hmm. Nah. I think it's fine if we stay outside. What do we have here? AC2 turret? Yeah, go for it. I like some long range. Contact high. Oh! Uh-oh. I like some long range, is what he said. Scratch that target. And the VTOLs are coming. Target destroyed. I am so happy, by the way, that we got these turret. There's another anti-air turret that I could drop. Really good. Ow. Getting hit. It's not good. So where was the anti-air turret that I could deploy? Oh, down here. Good. Again, anti-air is just so damn important for these swarms of VTOLs. Get the scout for some extra DP. Sure. Okay, okay, okay. So I think we are safe against air units now. Should be fine. Ammo yeah, ammo low. That's a problem. I do wonder if there's an ammo dump in the in the base. Mm, not happy. I am not happy at all. These tanks are scary, man. Target destroyed. We somehow need to take him, though. Commander, we have lost one of our AMS turrets. AMS turret down. I thought you would never attack them, but okay. Interesting. So, um, yeah, guys, um, how do we play this now? Shall we push out? I need to get ammo so bad. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Good news is. Yes, there's a lot of them, but we can crack these tanks relatively easily. We have a lot of DP, so more turrets would be very nice. 300 missiles. We need more missiles! As crazy as that sounds. For a mission like that, 100%. So, I guess it is gonna be a drop on the LRM-20, down to a 15. Can you take these? Oh, let's go around. We're gonna take the other uh, entrance. 
So dropping the ammo car, uh, dropping the, the amount of launchers for more ammunition is probably the way to go. What do we have here? AMS turret. Uh, I really want to get some more offense now. I think they're already in the base. Oh yeah, they are. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, they are totally in the base. Target acquired. Alright. Where destroyed. is my other entrance? Let me know, please. I also want Ravager turrets. Come on, give me a Ravager somewhere. What's that? AC2. AC2 is fine, it's good enough. And I think it's high... Yeah, high up enough that we can use it to destroy the tanks in the center. Hopefully. Hopefully he's not getting destroyed himself. Would have been a waste then. Okay, coming around. Oh boy. I'm dumb firing. Got a little bit of damage, but nothing too bad. Uh, I'm out of ammo. I'm about to be out of ammo. Ammo the freaking pleated. Um. Okay, you can handle this, I believe. What I now need is a little corner where there's a little package on the... Uh, uh, on the ground. Scratch that lets target. me rearm my, my guns. Destroy the Atlas Swarm. Yeah, right? <laughs> I don't think we have it here, right? This is a turret. I think it was a decoy. Target acquired. So... What are we doing now? Now that our strongest mech is basically disarmed. I'm gonna take control of the Annihilator. Okay, let's get some large lasers going. Not enough DP. Hmm. Okay. Time for an Annihilator then. <sighs> we need them to come close. Oh, I hate it. Really we also don't have that many here. shots here. Uh, this, is a, this is a prototype mech. You can see the silhouettes of the atlases. Alright. 900 meters. Our optimal range is... Contact. It's okay. It's okay. Incoming missile. Atlas down. One of them. Target Some of them have gauss rifle. Oh, crap. Get out of here. Get out of here now. We need them to come closer before we do anything. Let's get back. Can we build some layers of defense? Yo, a ga a guys, I want you to be here. Move a like, group. Right here. Get into cover. Please. Like everybody, now. It's one of those, right? It's one of those scenarios where they wouldn't wouldn't do what I want. Get away. Everybody here. Everybody here. So. Atlas. We have a bunch of them. We have 185 shots in our ammo bins. Orders. Yes, I should really look for more ammunition. So our autocannon 2s are firing like a boss. That's the thing I love. Atlas already in range, so we're gonna open this. Say hello. Send him to an early grave. And then say goodbye. Still a freaking Atlas man, has so much armor. I don't think we can handle this, not with a single annihilator. Oh, uh, crap. Oh, crap. Yeah. Um. I say. Let them have the first layer of defense. If anything. Hmm. Hmm. I really want to engage them, but I'm scared. Because we have too many of those uh, here at the same time. We still have the high ground there, you know? It's kind of bad for us. We have a bunch of these brawling atlases here. Open the gates! A little. Hey, Atlas. 
I mean, that's a way to get him down. Auto cannon turret doing the auto cannon thing. Crap! The large lasers! Does this Atlas count as destroyed? It doesn't seem like it. Hmm. I really don't know how to engage this. These Atlases are a problem. A real problem. I think what we need is... We need, we need to actually find ammo. So let's see if we can find ammo. Is this an ammo bin? It's not. But I really do believe that our auto cannon twos are doing the job. Not enough DP, obviously. Ammo, ammo! Any ammo? This is not ammo. This is also a decoy, huh? It's a flamer. A <laughs> flamer turret! Ready to engage. So what happened here? Ah! Don't blow up the Annie. Are we fighting? Are they inside the walls? No, I think my friends went outside the walls. Eh? No? Yes? Maybe? Uh, it's fine. Okay. Mm, that's not good. Get the Atlas out of the way. So the back shot worked. Our Thunderbolt is getting kicked, though. Okay, so another Atlas bites the dust. We have now four of these Atlases. Ugh. Right at our gaze. But they are somewhat damaged already. Okay, let me see if I can take this. We twist it. That's next level. We gotta take... Yeah, the one here. Headshot. Oh! Where's your head, buddy? I cannot see anything. And the last guy. Come on. Get down. Oh boy! So, do we want to wait for the final wave to get some extra goodies? I think the answer is yes. I think the answer is actually yes. So let's wait for them to come from any angle. PPC turret, huh? Sure. No. It's good enough. What? Wait. What? What is that? Are you saying this is ammo? Deploy a light mech. Nah, that's not what I want. That is not what I want. Thunderbolt and Annihilator, not in a good spot. We have one of our guys out of ammo. Worst case scenario is we run, so we're gonna keep that breach as our evac spot. Defeat the hostile units. Fourth wave. Decoy is only 10 DP. Hmm. Yeah, we need to know what's coming. It's a 7 and a 26 unit drop that we will face. Ba -ba -bum. What's being fired? Oh, that is being fired. That's good, because we have so much anti-air. It's not gonna be a problem. I think I don't even have to shoot anything here. Ah, maybe that. Ammo is a thing. Target destroyed. Ah, leave it to the anti air turrets. Oh, you got my PP. That's not nice. Don't hit my PP. See, Target turret. Acquired. I think we actually have to intervene here. Yeah. Okay, so these are falling out of the sky now. That's good. We have those anti air turrets for exactly that reason. Blam. Missed that. Okay. Target destroyed. That's down. Target destroyed. That's down. Oh, Target missed acquired. it. Mm, I think it's fine. 
I think we don't have to do anything. Oh, we have to do a thing. Commander, we have lost one of our AC2 We turns. have to do a thing, and that is defending the flank. The flanking defend. Alrighty then. Okay. Uh, there is no gate here. Wait, is this a... That's not a repair bay, is it? <gasps> Wait. And I, I enter air? Yeah, 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 or whatever. Restock ammo! The entire lands! We found it! Let's go, everybody! Let's go! <laughs> Oh, finally. And I, I can't imagine this is also a repair bay that we've seen there. Alright, so we are cooking again. Perfect. Oh, you, you, you don't, don't, no. Thunderbolt, you are almost down. Yeah, yeah, that's what I mean. That's my job. Let me handle it. <laughs> yes! Ultimate power! Okay. I think we're gonna get it. I think we're gonna get it done. Oh my gourd. It's kinda tough. Alright, Annihilator half down. You know what? I just I deploy a flamer turret. This guy is running rocks and ear peeps. And <laughs> he got so overwhelmed. All right, flamer turret, be bigger. I think we got it now. If we really wanted to cheese it, we should check out if it's an actual Target repair destroyed. bay. Oh, manticore Target wave. Acquired. Manticore wave, you say? Hmm. The thing is, I can solo it now. I can totally solo everything. It's 30 manticores, though. Target acquired. 30. Too early. Right? No, we actually hit him. Okay, so this is where we make our stand and hope that we hit the mantis without a problem. Target is this the last wave? Really wonder. Can I hit him? I cannot hit him. So we gotta change target to something else. I should probably attack the guys on the high ground there. It's not hittable, huh? Okay. Alright then. Let's go for these then. Because they are right in my face. So one alpha strike enough? Okay. Yeah, I guess. It's so many manticores, guys. Stay here, stay with me. Where are you going? New friends are doing dumb shit again. Oh, I hate it. Okay, just don't get killed. You can have some fun with these manticores as well. It's so many though. We only destroyed six so far. Seven, eight, good. We got nine. Uh, it's fine if they attack me, actually. Because I still have armor. Another one. We are at 12 now. 12 out of 30. Good. 14. If we can keep the left flank clean, then my friend should have an easy, easy time there. Yeah, it looks like it. Looking at the bottom there, you can see the Target paper dolls of my friends, and they are still looking alright. We have more than half of them down now. God, it's so Target much. But you know what? We need Target all of these things that we put into the mech to actually succeed this kind of mission. Otherwise, we would have been completely stomped. Alright. Helping them here is kind of important. I know I could activate a sensor sweep. Can you take him? You can take him. Alright. Okay, I need to know. I need to know if this is an actual repair bay that we can utilize. That's pretty good. I'll do it. I'll do it with the... 
Is it any or is it the Thunderbolt? I think it's... Maybe we can use it twice. I don't know. Let's go here. And I want to take a look at my ammo count. We have 1,480 LRMs. Does it change after the repair bay? Because normally these repair bays, by default, yeah, they work as also restocking bays. It's pretty good. Did we win, son? Also, can I use them multiple times? Target is down. Yeah, you got this. Uh, where, where am I? <laughs> I lost track. No, wait. No, the repair bay was here and now it's not anymore. Correct? I'm not entirely sure. Oh. Oh, here they are. Kablam! So, three manticores left. Target destroyed. And that's the last boy. And we whiffed it. Okay. Woo. Let's get out of here. Hey. We won. We won the mission. That was crazy, man. And I think if we didn't have the cheese of our LRMs here, we would have lost that mission so hard. But we didn't. And that's why we are getting 2 million sea bills and 20... Seven picks of whatever that is. You were a Templar. That's cool. Um, I mean, Clan Arrow. Who can say no to that? Naga. Not bad. Do we take three parts of a Naga? Or do we take the Arrow? Lots of Atlas stuff, of course. Longbow, Charger, Victor Highlander, Stalker, and so on. Um, Archer. No, that's all no. So you can see there's a lot of stuff that we can scroll through. I want arrow ammo twice. We have 20 shots with that thing now. Jump shadows. No, thank you. I don't think that there is anything valuable here anymore, so I'm gonna scroll past all of it. Lots of single heat sinks. There is ammo. Is there any LB10 ammo? Because my annihilator needs more. AC10, AC5. I'm just skimming right now. I just want to see if there's anything. But no, I don't think so. And if there was anything like that, then it's fine. Absolutely fine. So, I want that Naga. Where's the Naga? God, that's crazy. There it is. So we take one part of a Naga and continue. So, that might seem like we had not, get, we had not gotten a lot of stuff out of here, but... Normally, you would get some goodies afterwards, huh? Huh, fortress? Where's my, where's my extra? No extra? I think it's fair. I think it's fair, but you know what? It was a nice test run for the ridiculous Orion that we have built. I hope you enjoyed the episode, guys. And if you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.